Hey there, everyone. Going to you here, and this is the most unfortunate thing I've ever had to do. Uh, I have to immediately start this episode with crafting. I'm not looking forward to it, just because I'm gonna have to keep just going through stuff if this doesn't work. So let's just do I'll what we always do, but, and I'm just gonna save a different slot just in case. You can never be too sure these days. Okay, okay your brother made four good luck, says Morgana. Thanks, Morgana. Love to hear your inspirational things. Let's make four stun yeah. guns. Make it alone, because Kabakami can't do what I need to do. <laughs> oh my god, first try, let's go! Yes. Uh, yeah. That makes me feel so much better. I was really worried about that. Thankfully, I don't have to do this shit tomorrow. Nice. But tomorrow's going to be a long day. That is for sure. Let's go to bed. Don't mind if I do. I've been thinking lately. About those phantom thieves, I mean. If Dad were still alive... Sorry, I... I shouldn't bring this up while we're eating. It's okay. Keep going. I just wonder if he would have been on their side. That's all. The only reason you have time to think about that is because you depend on someone else. It's not... You don't have to do a single thing, and you're provided with food, clothes, a home. I've had no time to think on such ridiculous thoughts. Would Dad have been happy with them? I don't care. He died upholding some lofty sense of righteousness, leaving all his responsibilities on us. Uh, all I was trying to say was... Isn't it about time you grew up and acknowledged our situation? Right now, you're useless to me. All you do is eat away at my life. <sighs> Sorry, that was uncalled for. I'm just really tired. I'll be eating dinner out from tomorrow on. <sighs> well, that don't feel too great. Nah, I'm not gonna lie to you. I just remembered. I've even seen a lot of shows on TV lately about those families of hearts. Yeah, they're pretty cool, aren't they? Love those guys. Uh, why bother stealing hearts? You can't do anything with them? I mean, have you, have you not read a science fiction novel in your lifetime, lady? Go with some of the concrete clear value like gold? I don't know. Another kind of metal that's very valuable in its own way, I would please you tell. They're called minor metals and they're used in many electronics. In fact, most of you probably have some on your person right now, in your pockets and your purses. Give me an answer. Aren't they supposed to be in our lockers, though? You're not going to yell us about that? Oh, the comic sounds being called out. Give me one example, son, most of you have that contains minor metals. <laughs> oh, now An's freaking the fuck out. Hey, wait! Now the cat's backseat classing. Hey, this is <laughs> so good! So, let's see here. What thing do we have on us that uses minor metals? She's got lipstick, smartphone, mascara. Uh, I mean, if your lipstick or your mascara has minor metals in them, I mean, that's actually, that, that that's a thing, I think, but I don't think I'd want to put that in my eyeballs. So it's a smartphone. <laughs> it's something about electronics, right? Yeah, okay, she did. I'm finished. This is it. Correct. That is such a large roll of tape on that podium. What the hell? Sheesh. Although everyone's just always just like taking it back whenever someone gets something right. Like everyone's just stupid. 90% of the minor metals used in Japan are imported. Oh, that's that's cool. Good you got those relations. But a lot of the recyclable trash you throw away contains minor metals too. The junkyard is more 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 valuable than someone's heart. I mean, damn, that's kind of cold, but okay. Yeah, well, whatever you say. Nice going. All right, yeah, give me that charm. All right, that's charm point. Yeah. Got nothing. Are we out of luck? It's no fair his palace is up in the sky. If only we could contact the real Kanashiro. Hmm? What do you want? Nothing in particular. I just saw you all together here. Huh, that's so. You seem to be having quite a bit of trouble. So you're here to check up on us? You may be the student council president, but when it comes to what we do, you're useless. 
useless? Right now, you're useless to me. You guys remember what happened 30 seconds ago? All you do is eat away at my life. life, life. To be frank, yes. Just stay on your high horse and watch. Or do you want to eavesdrop since you're so good at it? <sighs> so you wish to get in contact with Kaneshiro? That is what you were just discussing, weren't you? It seemed you just needed to find out where he is. <laughs> Not from you. Uh, something like that. Hey, you don't gotta answer her honestly. So you're just the good girl type to push over. Right now, you're useless to me. I'm not. What was that? Fine. I'll help you meet Kaneshiro. What exactly is she planning on doing? She had a dead serious look in her eyes. Does this mean she has an idea as to where Kaneshiro may be? I highly doubt that. I didn't like her stern face. Ugh, what is up with her? There are way too many people here. <sighs> We're never gonna find her. Hello? It's me, Makoto Nijima. Just stay on the phone and listen. Make sure you record the call as well. Huh? Who is it? Do you guys know Kaneshiro? What? That idiot! What's she doing? I heard I could find someone named Kaneshiro if I came to Central Street. Central Street? She's being too rash. What are you getting at? He's blackmailing the students of Shujin Academy, is he not? Tell him if he doesn't want me talking to the police about it, he better agree to meet with me. You got a death wish or something? He says he'll meet you. Get in. You better be taking me to Kaneshiro. He said get the fuck in! Wasn't that... It's the guys that messed with us the other day. So they were connected to Kaneshiro. Is she still on? Contact Kaneshiro-san. Tell him we got a good one. Where are we going? Yeah, I guess we can't do anything to her if she's Kaneshiro-san's customer. Hey, I asked a question here. Where are we going? We gotta go after them! Ryuji, get a taxi. I'll... Okay, I've got their license plate. But sketching skills will come in handy. Ah, shit, he ignored me! Damn it, I said stop! Ryuji! Hurry up and get in! So, you're seriously the student council president of Shujin. You know what happens to anyone who snaps at me, don't you? So, whose number is this? Your boyfriend? What in the world? Who the fuck are you? Nijima-san! What the hell did you do to her? Oh, I get it. You got followed, you dumb shits! Moly! That bag you saw the other day, the crocodile one, how much was it? About three million. Ah! <gasps> For real? Better thank those guys. What? I'm royally pissed right now. Can you tell? You know how spending money relieves stress? 
It's you goddamn brats sniffing around like dogs and barging in here like you own the joint. See this empty space? I'm so pissed that now there's a three million yen gap here. It pisses me off even more if I don't fill it up. I'm a perfectionist. So, good luck. What is that supposed to mean? Come on, you all look so tense. I think I'll call it debauchery of minors at a club. So. Uh, that's. Sorry, I accidentally dropped my controller a little bit. Oh damn, I got booze and cigs in the shot. Maybe some drugs too. Ah, oh, this is so hilarious. I'm, I'm just gonna go back real quick. Let, let, let's uh, let's just play this back real quick. I think I'll call it. Debauchery of minors at a club. So, can I send this to your school? All right, let's get a grip on the controller and continue. I feed on dumb shits like you. Understand, pretty little student council president. Now listen up. Run your mouth to the police, and I'll break all of you, starting with your families. I want to give you the usual month, but well, you have such a large group here. Three weeks. Bring three million yen by then, no less. Summer bonuses are around the corner, you know. It'll be easy if you beg your mommies and daddies. <laughs> now get out of my sight. I'm about to have some fun. What? To hell with that! Don't bother with him. Makoto's safety is more important right now. Three weeks for three million yen. Things are taking a serious turn for the worse. You can say that again. I'm so sorry. I didn't mean to drag you in like this. <laughs> for real. I was stupid. I must agree. You should have easily imagined this happening. Hey, Yusuke! He's got no chill. I was so caught up in trying to be useful. All right, enough of the blame game. What's done is done. I'm gonna cause trouble for Sis, too. Sis? My older sister has a commendable job, and she's a much more remarkable person than me. A lot happened after we lost our father three years ago. So it's just us living together. But I'm still a child, so all I am is a burden to her. And that's why you were so reckless? I just wanted to be useful in some way to someone. You know, I might not get your whole situation, but ain't it a bit off saying that you're useless to her? It's the truth, though. In particular, I have to apologize for what happened to you. Huh? Now that I think on it, the truth about Kamashita must have been covered up by the whole school. I had my suspicions, but I couldn't do anything about it. No, I didn't do anything. Had I cared enough, I could have done something. <sighs> People like me must really be what others call scum of the earth. Real scum wouldn't call themselves that. Huh? I'm the same. It's just like you said before. I was closest to Shiho, but I didn't do anything. Besides, Kamoshida's the one to blame. Shiho understands that, and I do too. Takamaki-san. You didn't have a place to belong either. Isn't that right? Me either? We won't let anyone fall victim again. Now, what should we do from here? I'll do something about the money. So can we please just drop the case with Kanashiro? No can do. We're all caught up in this. We can't have you rushing things on your own anymore and making the situation worse. If only we could do something about that bank. Ryuchi! Bank? Oh, right! The bank! 
She isn't useless at all. She may be our key in. Hear me out, you guys. Our key in? What do you mean? A cat? Um, are you all okay? <laughs> we've become Kaneshiro's targets. That means we've become customers of Kaneshiro's bank. I see. The reason why we couldn't enter before was because we weren't considered his customers. And wouldn't you say that she in particular is a special customer? Let's take her with us. She is responsible for our current situation. Whoa, I don't follow this at all. She risked her life doing something so reckless. At the very least, she has the right to know. Won't you come with us? What? Wait, to where? Yeah, where are we going? Beats me. Canine? It's Fox. Be quiet. The shadows are going to notice us. A monster cat? I'm not! That's Morgana, the cat that was in his bag. This is what happens when we come here. That voice. Takamaki-san? You can tell by the hair. Where are we? We're inside Kaneshiro's... Uh, well... The world inside his heart. What? It's another reality in which Kaneshiro's distorted desires have materialized. Another reality? It's floating in the air. Th this is reality? <sighs> My goodness. <sighs> I'm sorry, it's just... But since this really exists, I can't doubt it. A reality that one's heart shows. Is it like the application of optical illusions in social cognitive psychology? Fucking dweeb. That's something we have no idea about. I see. So stealing one's heart... That may be like overriding their cognition. I think I kind of get the logic behind it. Ain't she more amazing than you? Well, we're about the same! Then, does that mean there's an ATM version of myself somewhere in this world, too? Perhaps. Regardless, we can change Kaneshiro's heart and make him confess if we steal his treasure. If it all goes well, that is. <laughs> we'll make it go well. Everyone will notice us for sure if we take someone like Kaneshiro down. Our justice will also become resolute. Think we'd be able to give courage to those in need if it happens? For the sake of those in need, huh? You sound like my father. Your father? No, that don't mind me. You want to go to that bank, right? Let's go then. If I've become a customer of that bank, then they'll have to let me in. For real? It came to us! It's just as I calculated. You know how you can use your card to get into banks during after hours? I thought that I'd be able to get in, since I have the same identity as such customers. I'm kind of Shiro's source of revenue after all. Ah, oh, that makes sense. Wow, this place is huge. I rarely gotta go to the bank, so this is making me kind of nervous. Being in a bank with costumes like these is so obvious. We're totally robbers. You got that right. It seems there will be a lot of shadows from here on. Huh? What's that about? Enemies attack us here. I see. I've trained in Aikido. Don't worry. I can defend myself. Self-defense won't do much good against shadows. But then again, it's better than nothing. We have to go in from the front, don't we? I'm an honorary customer. 
so I'd better act like one. I will be useful for you guys. Come on, let's go. Uh, you're just gonna hit me with price right now? Well, I won't say no to that. Let's see, who's in our party? Uh, oh, okay, this is the right party. Because we don't want on in here right now. But, can I just... I'm just gonna shut up for a second. I should write something. This is Shall we go? probably my second favorite dungeon theme in this game. This song's so fucking good. What business do you have here? I had a feeling this would happen. Come at us. No, no, wait! She's one of Kaneshiro's customers. I'd like to speak with the bank president. Excuse me, but do you have an appointment? I need to talk to him. Now let me through. Let him pass. That voice. It's Kanashiro. Yo, banks have presidents? Yes, but not the political sorts. In theory. Please wait. Reception is to the right, towards the back. I strongly advise that you do not attempt to go elsewhere. So, yeah, that's the, we, we can't go anywhere else if we wanted to. It'll just make us go the right way, so no point being around the bush. Oh, thanks, man. I figured that one out. So let's just run. I'm, I'm ready. That was just to the right. Don't go anywhere else. Wait, I'm going to go down that hallway. Incredible. Yeah, that's pretty fun. I wonder what the, the technological advances that have been made in the past five minutes were to make that bank float. Ooh, hurry on inside, don't mind if I do. Ooh, a mountain of cash, huh? How many beef balls could I eat with this? Unauthorized entry, property damage, and other disturbances. That comes to three million yen in total. You're here regarding that, correct, Miss Beautiful President? It must be quite tough gathering so much money. I'd be willing to give you a loan, you know. You gonna call it off then? No, a loan. The interest rate is 10% a day. 10% interest a day? Um, uh, that means uh, one day is... It's 300,000 yen. There's no need to be alarmed. I have a more manageable option for people like you. That was your plan from the beginning, wasn't it? Quite the impressive insight, Nijima-san. Or should I say, the younger sister of the beautiful prosecutor, Sai Nijima. How do you know that? Please don't underestimate our intelligence network. My, what wonderful goods have come falling into my lap. Don't be ridiculous! Young women are such great assets. They lack strength, be it social, physical, or mental. It's as if they only exist to be devoured by the strong. That just might be the rule since the dawn of history. Uh... You truly are despicable. You better be ready, Kanashiro! We're gonna snatch your treasure from you! Don't make me laugh, you petty thieves. My citadel has the highest security installed in it. Anyone will do anything for money. I'll rob you of your lives as easily as I breathe air. <laughs> Get them! It's Mr. Kaneshiro's orders. Eliminate them at once. All right. So as far as I'm aware, these guys don't have any weaknesses, but can they be put to sleep? <laughs> yes, they can. So with that in mind, uh, what? I mean, a headbutt sounds pretty fun, right? I like the sign of that. As he gets knocked down. Oh yeah, fuck it. Let's just 
Let's just do it again. Uh, you go to sleep. It should be. Uh, it's oh, me, <laughs> Do we do we try and hold out hope that this will actually be the thing that knocks him down? It didn't knock him down. Let it fucking go, Morgana. You suck. Uh, oh well. I guess we'll just uh, uh, do we try to freeze him? Oh uh, great, my OLED pixel refresh warnings on the screen right now. <laughs> Rampage, don't do that. Two of us took damage from that. How rude. Uh, whatever, we're just gonna fucking... Hopefully this isn't something that they're strong against. I don't know, it's really hard to see. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, the morning went away. Okay, that guy got inflicted with shock, so... We love technicals. And then, uh... You, you know, we, we know that he's strong to... Physical, but... You can't pass up a giant slice, because that bugger's dead anyways. Oh, we're doing this shit again, huh? I really wish I had Lullaby. That would that would be the best right. thing. All right, Ryuji. We're just doing it again. Oh my god, so many technicals. No, oh, I did knock him down, though. What does this do? I tend to confuse. Only I can technical off that, though. Yeah, fuck it. It can be fun. I, I just want to do something different. You, you don't really... Like, SP does not matter in this situation at all, basically. Oh, cool. That guy got frozen. So have fun with that. What are you gonna do? Oh, you threw away devil fruit, man. That was delicious. Why would you do that? Listen, okay, it's just gonna technical off that guy. So let's let's uh let's hit him with Yes, yeah, CO. Nice big technical. And now we're gonna throw it over to Yusuke. Because this will technical off that. Fuck yeah. No time to die, bitch. Get all out attack. Ugh, combat's so fun in this game. Don't go again. What the? There's no end to them. Have they really been hired with money? We're in trouble at this rate. Let's run. I don't want to kick their ass. That'd be easy. Why did the security guards turn into monsters? And what were those supernatural powers? Could those have been the personas you mentioned? Does now really look like the time to be asking that? We need to retreat. Makoto, make sure you don't get separated from us. Hurry, Joker. The exit's just over there. That, that, that thing's having some like Z fighting all the way back there. You see that? All right, let's go. <laughs> You seem to be in quite a pickle. How dare you sneak around, Kaneshiro? Those would be my words. However, I do thank you for providing me with such wonderful goods. It's time you disappear. <laughs> Managing a bank is tough as it is. So, it's my policy to kill clients who are more trouble than they're worth. Having one impertinent brat disappear is enough to set an example in that other world. Please, stop! Oh, I wouldn't damage an asset like you. They're dead men walking, but you'll be just fine. Your sister is quite a beauty, though. I'll make sure to make her my personal slave. Once I get bored, I'll just sell her off. Oh, poor sis. She could have been successful, if only her younger sister wasn't so dumb. My sister has nothing to do with this! Then you better start taking customers tomorrow. All you gotta do is endure it, and do as you're told. Endure it. Do as I'm told. You'll learn three million yen in no time. Although your life and everything along with it will be a complete wreck by then. <laughs> uh, 
I've been listening to you go on and on. Shut your damn mouth, you money-grubbing asshole! Huh? Have you decided to tread the path of strength? Yes. Come to me! Very well. Let us proceed with our contract at once. I am thou. Thou art I. You have finally found your own justice. Please, never lose sight of it again. This memorable day marks your graduation from your false self. What the hell?! Persona? No, dude. It's a bike. I can feel it. Myself. Me. Got it. <laughs> wow. Nice. What is that? I've never seen anything like it. <clears throat> you better earn your keep. Or else I'll kill you! I will not lose heart again. Ever. I'll go full speed, non-stop. Right, Johanna? <laughs> Don't get all cocky just because I normally behave myself. I am done playing nice! Let's go, Johanna! The enemy's agitated. Take them down and make an opening. So the award for the coolest fucking persona in the universe goes to Makoto. She's got a goddamn bike. I mean, come on now, bro. Really? That's just the coolest shit in the world. Uh, so once again, the, the awakenings in this game are just so fucking good consistently. I love them. Uh, I really wish that Morgana was the one that got switched out in Ryuji, but I mean, I guess I'll take All what right. I can get. Missed. Let's oh, go. cool. My turn anyways. Although, I kind of would like to be able to do that again. Yeah. Don't miss this time, will ya? This is fucking Morgana. I'm not lucky punching this guy again. I will confuse this guy, though. This sounds like fun. Okay, no, you get up. That's... Uh, okay, everyone's fine here. Except for the fact that me and Makoto are fucking frozen. Let's go. I could do that, but I'm not going to. I'm just going to do this. Alright, cool. So we're going to get a big old crit here. 97 damage, huge crit. Uh, so only Morgana. Uh, you know, it's it's fine. I'm just going to, I guess, heal everyone. Or maybe I can uh, make them not frozen? No. That's not a thing I can do right now. Whatever. We'll just, just heal everyone. Look at that. Big, big healing numbers. And now for not great stuff. It's a technical one more. Okay, yeah, you hit Yusuke. Good job. Proud of you. Okay, we'll just we'll just start with the nuclear attack again. I guess I should. Uh, I have one of these things right that I can heal with. Uh, this is HP stuff. Do I, do I not have any... I, I don't know if this is considered non-special ailment. Uh, okay. Well, if that's the case, whatever. Just, uh, make this guy dizzy. I'm still frozen. I'm assuming I can just get this off. Nice, a critical. Uh, no, let's go to Yusuke. You know, he doesn't... I don't think I can do slight kinetic damage in in this, right? I, right? I don't have that yet. Curse and steel, electric damage, curse. Yeah, n n no side stuff. Isn't this just a, a goddamn mess and a half? Well, whatever. Did I eat baton pass? I, I don't think I did. I'll just boost you. Maybe we'll freeze him. Oh, I did baton pass. I'm really good at fucking lying. Oh, yeah. Cool. No extra one up for him, though. Uh, I'll do Heat Wave, because that guy's dizzy. 
Oh. Oh, that's right, I already knocked him down, though. Like, it's been so long since I've actually, like, done combat in this game, I don't know what the fuck's going on, but he just knocked Makoto down. He's gonna fucking destroy Makoto. Makoto's going to die, right now. <laughs> this is fucking great. This is going wonderful. Uh, where, where's the thing that lets me revive? This episode's a piece of shit. Uh, I, I'm really just letting this one slide through my fingers right here. Wait, do I really? Did I not buy Reviver Revivibibi? Whatever the fuck those things were? Oh yeah, Revival will be bombs life. Okay. I'll do that. Morgana will heal. Maybe I'll just use a fucking physical mirror at this point. Because apparently I, I just need to use it. Buffala. No, don't. Why you gotta freeze me? Oh, thank God. Alright, okay, well, I guess we'll do this. Yeah, oh, I, I healed that guy, but it's fine. That guy's dead. That's all that matters, because now this is just wraps. Ooh, look at this in Makoto's thing? That's the real question. I'm hoping this works. Oh, that's a shame. Whatever. Now you're also just going to fucking die, because I'm going to kill you. Almost just use energy drop there. Because <laughs> of where that thing was automatically placed. Uh, see you later, fucko. That was awful. Let's get out of here. That should have been uh, not as long as it took. I'm just padding. Ooh, cool. Ryuji's level 23, but she was in my group. We know how to get in now. Our objective's been accomplished. But how are we getting out? There's only one exit, right? So, you're totally the fist of the Phantom Star now, huh? Do you want to get smacked? I'm going on ahead, so follow me. Damn. Okay, we have a path. Get in! So you'll stand against me no matter what. Very well. I'll wait for you all. There's no escape in reality, nor will you break through the security system here. It doesn't matter what you do, you can kiss your bright futures goodbye. Man, talk about wild! That was no Aikido, that was some hardcore ass whooping! I am so not pissing her off. Feel like she'll rip off my arm. She does exude that aura. Oh, stop it. <laughs> this is the most exhausted I have ever gotten these past few years. But it felt pretty great. I never thought I'd become part of the phantom thieves I was after. Sis might faint if she found out. You mentioned her earlier. She's a prosecutor for the district, and she's investigating the Phantom Thieves. Wait, ain't that bad? No need to worry. A normal investigation would never lead them to a world like that. Then again, it must have been fate for this to happen. What do you mean? I can't be like my sister. I had a feeling that there'd come a time when we wouldn't see eye to eye anymore. I'm thankful to have a sister who works so hard, but there are times I feel sorry for her, too. And after hearing my persona's voice, I clearly understand how I feel now. It appears you're not as reserved as you make yourself seem. I was just doing whatever the adults told me to. Won't she be perfect as our advisor? She's fearless and has a sharp mind. Sounds good to me. We've needed someone like that for a while now. I'd be honored if I can help out. We had way too much testosterone anyway, so I feel much better. It's from Kaneshiro. He's reminding us of our debt. So the Kaneshiro over here doesn't know what happened inside the palace. That's right. But his palace will be affected if the real Kaneshiro's cognition changes. We can't be lax. 
Seems it'd be best to avoid unnecessary contact with him until then. Three weeks left, huh? There's that security system, too. But if we pull this off, it'll definitely be great! We'll crush him like a fly. I'll make him regret making me angry. Anyways, let's begin our operation tomorrow. First, we need to secure a route to the treasure, like always. You guys are finally starting to get used to this. I'll be waiting for the call to meet up. Uh, yeah, motorcycles are kind of cool. Those ones, at least. Yours is on a boat, though. Okay, yeah. The use case ain't what we're all thinking. Well, you also have a cannon? Okay, so Ryuji just lost, like, all credibility and effect I've ever given him because he's mentioning fucking One in Dead or Alive by Bon Jovi. Jesus Christ, I fucking hate that song. Uh, you know, that's a good point. You know how to ride a motorcycle. Oh, she's got a license. Well, cool. Aren't you just an overachiever? Uh, sh sure. What's, what's going on, Makoto? Uh, not this again. Uh, you must apologize. It was, a, it was my son that dragged you all into this mess. Yeah, you did misunderstand us. That much is true. I mean, we, we, we already flushed us under the bridge. Yeah. I mean... I guess, but also, uh, it's nighttime. We were just there. Oh, don't worry. You are going to be like a staple of my fucking party, essentially. Well, we were at odds with each other until just a while ago. But Ryuji's totally right. We need to work together to overcome this. Nice. Uh, yes, yes, she does. Yeah, I'll consider it, dude. Hey. Another box came for me. Oh, well, yeah, is this the, uh, oh. The things I was like, didn't I just buy a shit ton of recovery things? I found it. It came today. Let's do it. So I need to do another save here because there's, a, a, like, there's, there's a, a chalk dodge tomorrow. Uh, I don't know why I did that. I, I got to go downstairs to read my book. What's on the TV? Crimes don't happen inside a conference room. They're happening out there in the real world, understand? Uh, why are you telling me this? Oh. Drawing on your own first-hand experience is important. I mean, sure, I guess, but... I'm just gonna lecture a guy like that? Hey. Alright, so today we're going to read, and we're going to read, uh, Vague. Make sure you close up. <laughs> Takenoku girls are springing up like bamboo shoots, and there are more of them every day. Hey! Yeah, Takenoku Street over in Harajuku. You could learn about cutting-edge fashions there, but I'd say what's on the inside is more important. Yeah, this is a cool little place, I suppose. We'll go there a few times, probably. Oh. So now we've read that, we now know how to get to Harajuku. Which is just right in between Central Street and Shinjuku. Funny how that works right. out. Oh, I forgot to read the text. Wow, rude. <sighs> I mean, I guess that's fair, I don't know. I, I, I have clothes that look cool and then motorcycle shaped persona huh i have no fashion sense that's the punchline you know i can turn into a car too so it's like i feel a sense of familiarity <laughs> wow maybe your persona i get car sick and motorcycles are cooler uh okay yeah you just don't get it don't underestimate the power of four-wheel drive valid well, motorcycles are nice too, but it can't carry large numbers of people. Uh, not with that attitude. I really am special after all. Huh? Carry? No. Take somewhere? Something just crossed my mind. And it's no use. I can't remember at all. Huh. Eh, there's nothing I can do about it if I can't remember. I need to concentrate on Kaneshiro for now. Unlike you guys, Makoto's clever, so we can expect great things from her. But man, you really do have something special. Are you putting me down or gassing me up? Pick one. I just got lucky. Looks like I better step up my game too. Ooh, yeah, that's a rank up with Morgana right there. In case you couldn't tell. 
So kitty talk. If a negotiation with an animal type shadow fails, you can try again. All right. Cool. I know. After we deal with Kaneshiro, I should consult her about mementos too. I'm sure Makoto's brain can. Hello. Ah. We got Yusuke, and now Makoto. This guy has quite the luck. That's what I said. Could there be some reason for it? Nah, that can't be. All right, now time for, for pain. Uh, however, on the, the, the bright side... I'm sorry for asking you here like this. Oh, no, it isn't a problem. I actually find it refreshing to be asked to the student council room. Although it's somewhat nerve-wracking as well. I think I'm a bit nervous myself. Anyway... Um... I wanted to apologize. I'm... really sorry for everything. What do you mean? You know, how I blamed you for Kamoshida's sexual harassment? Well, I wanted to apologize for that. I've honestly been meaning to this whole time. To Kamaki-san. I realized later that Shiho was calling out for me, and I wasn't there to help her. I didn't want to admit my own guilt, so I took it out on you, Nijima-senpai. I'm very sorry. Hey, there is no need for that. In fact, I think the two of us are pretty similar. Huh? I was unable to save anyone. Not Suzui-san, and not any of Kaneshiro's victims. Okay, one of those is a big difference, though. I kept telling myself I wasn't at fault because I was simply following orders. But that was all a lie. I felt like I would be admitting my own worthlessness had I not shifted the blame off of myself. Fear of that worthlessness was probably why I acted so harshly toward you and your friends. I'm deeply sorry as well. I see. In that case, wanna call it even? Even? <laughs> You're right. How about we leave this conversation in the past? Mm-hmm. Oh, but one more thing. You're not worthless, Nijima-senpai. You were a bit reckless, but you're the reason we found a way into Kaneshiro's palace. And you even obtained the power to change people's hearts. You did that all yourself, Nijima-senpai. <laughs> That way of thinking is very much like you, Takamaki-san. When you confronted me about Suzui-san, I realized how dishonest and small I was. You're always very direct. That's what helped me finally realize the error of my ways. It turns out I'm a little slow on the uptake at times. Hey, can I call you on? Um, yeah, I... I'm going to do the same, M M Makoto. Ah, that's so embarrassing. <laughs> How about we get something to eat before we go home for the night? Oh, I know a place. There's a crepe shop at Central Street that totally stuffs their crepes. Do you want to split one? Mmm, let's each get a whole one and then we can go half and half on those. Yes, let's. After school today, right? We we love seeing some friendships blossoming on the battlefield. <laughs> hey, you know, funny. We, we, we learned how that once, uh, whatever. I believe some girls should be shown to those who are senior. Oh yeah, should we call you like Nijima-san or like Nijima-senpai? Just treat me the same way you would treat anyone else. I don't, uh, the... Hey, you know what? She said it. All right. I mean, I don't know. She's, she said it, not me. So I'm just going with the flow. Damn, look at that. <laughs> Did something happen? Ooh, secret between girls. Sounds like fun. Ryuji, don't we have our own secrets? 
I mean, what would happen if a teacher walked by and we're just like, yo, Makoto, and they'd be like, yo, dog, what? Just student hey, council president. Uh-oh. We're gonna get some chalk thrown at our forehead. And whether or not I dodge it or not is besides the point. I dodged it first try. Isn't that lucky? <laughs> yeah, I love that proficiency we got. Hey. And now our charm's going up. Didn't we level up charm not too long ago, so it probably won't level up anyways. And then again, those random stat increases with billiards just kind of make it hard to keep track of anything. <laughs> That's besides the point, though. Okay. Just a criminal that the police can't handle. We'll beat the crap out of them ourselves. So mission start, and the mission's going to be concluded very soon because we are going to the palace today, but that's going to start tomorrow. And then we get to make all the money in the universe, and I'm looking all really forward to that. So, next time, palace. It's going to be fun. Thanks for watching. Maybe the next one won't suck as much. <laughs>